Yo, what's going on YouTube? What's going on everybody, man? Welcome back to the channel. How are you guys doing out there today, man? I hope you're doing well, man. So we're back here with some more Bruce Springsteen. Gonna be checking out Thunder Road, all right? Thunder Road. Haven't ever heard of this song before. I've heard of something. Well, is it the same title? There's a country song. Um, or I don't know. There's a country song, Thunder Roars, Lightning Strikes. I can't, I don't know the name of it, but I've heard it a lot. Uh, but we're here with a different song. I don't think this is anything relatable to that other than maybe the sound, the title of the song sounds similar. But we've got Bruce Springsteen right here, Thunder Road. This was, uh, highly recommended on my last video from Bruce Springsteen. So thank all of you for tuning in, checking it out. Really appreciate that. Looks like he might have a, a little emblem right here of Elvis, it looks like. A pin of Elvis here on his guitar strap. I can't tell. It's pretty far. Uh, so maybe he was a fan of the king. And y'all let me know. He was called the boss. So we've got the boss, you know, looking up to the king, man. Let's go. That's awesome. Uh, let's go ahead and get into this one, though. Thunder Road. See, what's, see what it's all about. Here we go. Lambs, Mary's dress waves Like a vision she dances across the porch as the radio plays With that piano Roy Orbison singing for the lonely Hey, that's me and I want you only Don't turn me home again, I just can't face myself Somehow, hey, what else can we do now? Except roll down the window and let the 
definitely hear the sax keys. I feel like there's something more going on back there. I can't I can't make it all out. Okay, so with this one right here, it sounded like kind of a rekindling of love, man. Like they're taking another shot at this um, love of theirs. Um, and right there, he said, you know, the town's full, you know, full of losers. And it sounds like, but he came there to win. So uh, maybe win her love back, you know. But I'm going to take a look at it. I don't know. It sounded, seems like I'm missing some of the puzzle. So let's go ahead and see. I don't know. It, it seems, I, I think I'm getting the wrong interpretation of it. It seems kind of more sad than I thought. I thought it was kind of a rekindling of a love of a romance, you know, heading off into love at the, maybe at the tail end of life. Not, maybe not even the tail end, just later in life, a later in life. So he talks about how they're not young. They're not that young anymore, right? Um, and hey, they've got one more chance to kind of make this work. Uh, he goes on to say that she's got these pain, you know, she, she carries these pain um, that goes on. She's looking for a savior, right? She's always wanting a savior, but it sounds like all the guys she's maybe been with uh, weren't really worth her time. But um, but it seems like they got what they wanted, I guess, out of her because it talks about things like your gra they, they scream your name. He's talking about all these people, all these boys that she sent away. They haunt this uh, dusty beach well at least she's sending them away maybe that's a uh, significant part she sent them away because it goes on to say they scream your name at the uh at night in the street your graduation gown lies at their feet and what that makes me sound well, that's what that makes it sound like to me is uh they scored right they got something they they got some from her um her clothes lies at their feet in this lonely cool before the dawn you hear their engines roaring on when you get to your porch so that makes it sound like once uh she's she's walking home alone and they're taking off they they got what they wanted and she's going back home um that's the way it makes it sound and he's saying it's a town full of losers right these guys weren't worth the damn uh in your life i'm pulling out here to win so hopefully it's saying that um you know She's had a past, a history of losers, man, these guys that weren't worth the damn in her life, um, but that he's there uh, to try to make it right. He's saying he isn't no savior. He understands he's not the perfect guy. He's got his flaws too, but he's here to he's here to win with her. He's here to make this thing work. Let's give it a shot. Uh, we ain't as young as we used to be, um, but hey, we'll give this a real shot here. So maybe that's what it is. That'd be nice. For Thunder Road, we've got this song was released in 1975. It's called uh, Rock and Folk Rock Man from Miss Bruce Springsteen. Right here is the only songwriter, by the way. Really good. So the lyrics to Thunder Road describe a young woman named Mary, her boyfriend, and their one last chance to make it real. Musically, the song opens with a quiet piano and a harmonica introduction. Uh, that's Roy on piano and Springsteen on harmonica meant as springsteen said later in later years in the wings for will's documentary as a signifier that something was about to happen the title phrase is not used uh, until the middle section of the song after the closing line a tenor saxophone and render Rhodes duet is played by clarence clemens uh and bitten by ten in the instrumental instrumental coda all right, so they don't give any deeper meaning on here uh, than the initial about uh, a young name, uh, young woman named Mary and her boyfriend and them having one last chance to make it real. So it looks like I got the overall concept of the song on this one, man. Really good stuff. Uh, so yeah, I like the I like the final uh, line on that about a whole town full of losers, but I'm pulling out here to win. So I like that. I like that. Uh, it just paints a good picture that. Um, for maybe both of them, right? For both of them, they, they've struck out with a lot of people, but they feel like what they had was real. Let's give it another shot, man. I think we missed out. I think there was a connection there. So I like that, man. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the reaction here, tuning in with me today and Mr. Bruce, man. Lovely, lovely stuff, man. Thank you for the recommendation. Really appreciate that. By the way, if you guys enjoyed the video, please don't forget to like, subscribe, check out the descriptions down below for other ways you can help the channel, including becoming a member here on my YouTube, my Patreon, or donation requests if you so choose, man. With that being said, I'm gone. I'll see you on the next one. All right. Peace.